control blocks. In the last video, we reminded ourselves what blocks make Edison wait for a certain event to happen or a certain amount of time to pass. In this video, we will go over all Edison's control blocks. Using control blocks, Edison can make an activity repeat itself indefinitely, repeat itself a certain number of times, or until a certain event happens. The program ending block is also located here. For revision, also take a look at the control blocks sheet. Edison's control blocks are located in the menu section control. There are five blocks here in total and one of them has two modes. So, in total we have six different control options. Let's go through all of them and also create a program. Loop forever. The robot will keep on repeating the program blocks inside of the loop forever, which means you have to cancel the program yourself to end it by pushing the square button. Repeat number of times. The robot will repeat the blocks inside of the loop for a number of times that you have set. Repeat until the round button is pushed. The robot will repeat the program blocks inside of the loop until the round button is pushed. Repeat until the triangular button is pushed. The robot will repeat the program blocks inside of a loop until the triangular button is pushed. Repeat until an obstacle is detected. The robot will repeat the program blocks inside of a loop until it sees an obstacle. End program. This block stops the program from executing. If you set this block as the last block of the program, then no new blocks can be added because the right edge of the block is smooth. I made a program where first Edison plays 10 beeps, then slowly turns right 0.5 seconds at a time until the triangle button is pressed, and lastly it turns left 0.5 seconds at a time until the round button is pushed. Lastly, the robot tries backwards 0.15 seconds at a time until an obstacle is detected, after which it stops. In the very end, I'll put an end program block. Now it's your turn. Complete the challenge on the screen and see you in the next video. Challenge. Go to edblocksapp.com. Choose control from the menu and create a program which uses at least two different control blocks in a row. What did you come up with?